Queen Nanny of the Maroons is a legendary figure in Jamaican history, celebrated for her role in leading the Maroons, a group of enslaved Africans who escaped captivity and formed their own communities in the rugged hills of Jamaica's interior. Queen Nanny was born in the late 17th century in what is now Ghana, in West Africa. She was taken captive by European slave traders and shipped across the Atlantic to Jamaica, where she was sold into slavery on a sugar plantation. But Queen Nanny was not content to live out her life in bondage. Along with other enslaved Africans, she escaped into the rugged mountains of eastern Jamaica, where she and her fellow escapees established communities and waged guerrilla warfare against the British colonizers who sought to recapture them. Queen Nanny quickly became a leader among the Maroons, known for her intelligence, courage, and strategic thinking. She was said to possess supernatural powers, including the ability to communicate with the spirits of her ancestors and to render herself and her followers invisible to their enemies. Under Queen Nanny's leadership, the Maroons developed sophisticated military tactics and became a formidable force against the British. They established their own autonomous communities, with their own customs, traditions, and laws. Queen Nanny's legacy continues to inspire Jamaicans today. She is celebrated celebrated as a symbol of resistance against oppression and a champion of freedom and independence. In 1976, the Jamaican government declared her a national heroine, and in 2018, a statue of her was unveiled in the capital city of Kingston, where she stands as a powerful symbol of Jamaican resilience and resistance. Like and subscribe to our channel on YouTube at Ultra Digital Wave and website ultradigitalwave.com.